The age between when we begin earning and when we retire is 40-50 for most people. Most people have a stable income that coincides with financial obligations to achieve big-ticket goals. Any financial error made during this stage can negatively impact our ability to plan for a secure financial future. These are the four most common financial mistakes that 40-year-olds need to avoid. Don't increase your emergency fund. An emergency fund is a safety net to help you deal with unplanned financial situations. It can also be used to cover unexpected expenses such as those resulting from illness, disability, job loss, and other unavoidable circumstances. It should cover all your expenses, including utility bills, insurance premiums, and loan EMI for at least six months. You may have to take out loans that are more expensive or liquidate investments you have set aside for financial goals. The risk of defaulting on loan EMI is also higher if there are not enough funds. This could result in higher penalties and lower credit scores. Your emergency fund should be invested in liquid instruments like fixed deposits or savings accounts with higher yields, prioritizing higher education for children over the retirement goal. Parents naturally want to give their children the best higher education possible. Parents, particularly those in their 40s and 50s, are more focused on creating a sufficient fund to support their children's higher education. But, higher education savings should not be prioritized above post-retirement savings. You should save enough money for your retirement goals due to rising life expectancy and steep inflation and healthcare costs. Although provident funds are often available to salaried workers, the maturity proceeds may not be sufficient to cover the life expectancy of the retirees. Lenders are reluctant to offer loans to those over 60 because they don't have a regular income. Parents can, however, get education loans to fund their children's higher education. Once they begin earning, the loan can be repaid by them. Online retirement calculators can help you determine the monthly investments needed to build your post-retirement fund. You can invest any monthly surpluses after you have made retirement contributions to build your child's higher education corpus. An individual working should have at least 15% of her annual income for the best term insurance coverage. As with most young workers, those in their 40s mistakenly confuse insurance and investment. They end up investing in money-back policies, endowment insurance, and other similar investments. They offer inadequate life insurance and generate suboptimal returns. Term insurance is the best way to get adequate life insurance coverage at comparatively low premiums to protect yourself and your dependents from rising medical costs. You should also purchase sufficient health insurance. As insurance premiums rise with increasing age, it is important to purchase term life or health insurance policies as soon as possible. Avoid investing in equities to achieve your long-term financial goals. Although retail investors have been increasing their participation in equities over the past few years, many people in their 40s still avoid equities to meet their long-term financial goals. They prefer to invest in fixed income instruments like bank fixed deposits, NSC, public provision funds, NSC, or other small savings plans to reach their long-term financial goals. You should also note that fixed income instruments post-tax returns barely match inflation. However, equities as an asset class tend to outperform both inflation and fixed income assets by a large margin over the long term, especially if you have a longer investment period than seven years. You should not overlook investing in equities. There are some best investment platforms given in the description below, so don't forget to check them. If you liked the video then like and share and give your opinion through a comment. If you haven't subscribed to this channel yet, then do it now and also press the bell icon so that you can get notifications of my future videos. Thanks for watching.